Throughout my TV watching career, I fell in love with many shows, like Thomas the Tank Engine, which I love, The Simpsons, which I also love, and PBJ Otter, which always makes me feel like a kid. And Happy Tree Friends, well, I like the characters to cute and all, but there's lots of gross out here. Sure, PBJ Otter teaches life lessons and problem solving, and The Simpsons throw in a couple of life lessons themselves, and even there are caring parts on Happy Tree Friends, and Thomas teaches life lessons of life. But there's one show that teaches me something even better. Got a show for you. Veggie Tales. Always been making me laugh, and always has been teaching me Christian values. These are just the few of the Veggie Tales dudes I have. I did have all the shows, Volume Three, but sadly I lost it. But you know. This is gonna says I actually have VeggieTales All Shows Volume One and Volume Two. I mean, in Volume One I'm missing Larry Boy and the Fifth from Outer Space, and yeah, I'm also in this one I'm missing a couple of shows like, you know, I'm like missing two, but you know, I've got to say. I've always loved VeggieTales. You see, VeggieTales is a show that teaches Christian values. And why I love it is because, well, not only it teaches great Christian values, but it has lovable characters, and it also has a great variety of songs. And I mean, the songs from VeggieTales are amazing. In fact, I love them so much, I'm watching a sing-along tape of VeggieTales right now on my thing. My TV, yeah. But anyway, so, yeah. I definitely love VeggieTales. I think that... I don't think I don't think I have, like, a favorite. I like pretty much all of them equally. And the In the House and In the City reboots weren't really bad. The only thing I didn't like was, you know, it just... All the characters got dumbed down. There was very few biblical values. In fact, they stopped doing Bible stories after Abe and the Amazing Promise. Now they just decided to, you know, do biblical moral, morals instead of teaching new Bible stories. However, with the VeggieTales shows, they now teach teach not only Bible stories, but, well, they also have, like, other stories. The, uh, okay, the new VeggieTales reboot, the VeggieTales show, is amazing. I saw the pilot episode, which was the best Christmas gift. I saw the first episode and the second episode, but sadly... There's no way to watch the other episodes because I don't have Yippee. Either way, I love VeggieTales. And I will always cherish VeggieTales. Because, well, they have great songs and great stories. And they just always make, make me laugh. My favorite countertop scene, scene is, J, Dave and, is Dave and the Giant Pickle. I like both the opening and the closing. The opening is when we get introduced to Larry Boy, and then there's the whole Larry Go Round thing. That always makes me laugh. Then for the last countertop, it's full of funny stuff, like, you know, there's first, you know, Bob trying to avoid hearing the what we've learned song, but Larry foils him. And then, you know, when he gives out the verse, um, Larry asks if he can be turned into a chicken, and Bob Bob's like, uh, uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I always find that part hilarious. I love VeggieTales. Sure, I love Thomas the Tank Engine, like I said before, and PB&J Otter, and SpongeBob SquarePants, but none of them will teach great lessons like VeggieTales. VeggieTales teaches Christian values. I do like Jonah VeggieTales movie, too. It's, like, one of my favorite movies. You see Jonah as well. Oh, 
VeggieTales' first movie. It's also what partially caused the bankruptcy. That and also hit entertainment, Sue and Jonah. Oh no, Sue and VeggieTales. Because you see, these work for Lyric Studios. But then when the founder of Lyric Studios died, all the assets got, got you know, sold to hit entertainment. And VeggieTales was joined for a while until they just left. And then Hit Entertainment did a lawsuit. And because of that, VeggieTales filed for bankruptcy. And it was almost the end. But thankfully, Phil Vischer never gave up. Gave up and he kept going. And the creators are very great too. And and the songwriters, they're, they're amazing. VeggieTales is awesome. I just love VeggieTales. Every single episode. I, I love all of them. Even the crappy Netflix reboots. Even even the Noah's Ark episode. I love it all. VeggieTales will always be VeggieTales. Anyway, so that's all I have to say about this say for this video. So yeah. If you love VeggieTales too, subscribe to Drew Thomas and click the bell to be notified when we upload a new video. This is Drew Thomas saying, remember that God made you special and he loves you very much. Goodbye.